so we just made it to South Las Falls. South Las Falls, windy as hell here. Yeah, I did. Even getting this close, it starts getting real misty. It's putting up a lot of, lot of mist. But it's super windy, so I'm gonna get some footage and stop talking. Running to a guy that goes off every seven minutes. Look at all these people. <laughs> we just made it to it. everybody there's a little hot rod I think that's us we're headed about two hours away from here it's our first stop a place called story dollar it's probably the American way to say it anyways <laughs> but just wait until Isa to get out here and then we're on the road gonna hit breakfast first as hell here. You see them glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Mike can probably hear me pretty good. But we just got out. <laughs> we got out from underneath that beast. No more mist. There's these nice wooden stairs. Do you think they'd use something else other than wood if there's as much water around, but who knows? Ah, protected my bald head from all that water. Yeah, but that bad boy just goes down into this little stream here. Bueno. Well, Liza said you can walk up in there and the waterfall is in there. I just have to take my shoes off, which I'm going to do. Do you want me to, um, she's like, go check out how far you have to walk first. I'm like, yep, take my shoes off for these bad boys. So wish me luck. Here we go. No shoes. I think she sprung a leak. 
<laughs> we made this though. Pretty legit. So here is Kelder, where they have sod houses. The roofs were sod. There's a couple down here, right next to each other. A couple little bunkers down there. I guess this is a salmon fishing village when back in the 13th century, when Irish monks immigrated here. It's pretty neat. Wish I had my pole here. Could slam some salmon. Right now it's raining though. Still pretty neat. Kind of like out of like a Shrek movie. <laughs> but I think we're gonna move on. Liza's gonna get more pictures and then we're gonna move on. Ain't that right? That's right, Daddy. Oh jeez. We just made it to Vic, Vicky Myrtle, I believe the town's called. We're gonna eat here, Stronden Pub. Had good reviews online. Smells super good out here. Nice view from the from the restaurant. Nice little trail that goes out to the beach. We're gonna go check it out after we eat, but that's where we're stopped for now. Black Sand Beach. First time that I've ever been on a beach with black sand, honestly. I've been on like white sand beaches and just regular, regular beaches, but never been on a beach with black sand. Pretty interesting. I would say the sun's setting, but it's not. Because the sun doesn't set here till about midnight. morning everybody so we drove about an hour and a half from our hotel to this badass spot glacier lagoon first time I've ever seen glaciers and then uh, diamond beach is down there this lagoon feeds into the ocean and then there's a bridge down there and then diamond beach is actually the beach that's after the bridge so but yeah, we're just gonna check this out. This is our fifth full day here, and then tomorrow we gotta leave, unfortunately, but good way to start the day off. See some nice glaciers. And then we saw a seal up there somewhere, but should be another long, busy day. <laughs>
seal right there. Yeah. Wow. So ladies and gentlemen, this is officially Diamond Beach. Nice little icebergs. So they float down from the, the lagoon that feeds into the ocean down here. And then they get stuck out there and some of them get washed up on shore. Pretty neat place. You got little tiny ones and then you got some of these beasts that are up front that Liza's taking pictures of right now. The entire beach is black sand. Very big beach by the way. And then you got the snowy mountain caps in the back. Wow. We're running to see this, see if we can get footage of this whale. It's like feeding like probably 50 yards offshore, so. Oh boy. Stay tuned! There's a whale right there. Wow. Wow. There it is. There's that whale! Oh boy. It's gonna follow this bad boy. Hey, there's a seal right there in the water too. Wow. on that one. <laughs> no, they're slow. Be careful. Be careful, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, guess what? You're in my shot. This is where we're ending day four. Uh, the Grotta Lighthouse. Right there. Fortunately, can't walk up to it, but that's where we're ending the day. We're gonna drive back to Keflavik and then gotta leave pretty early tomorrow, around two to go to the airport. Officially just checked out of our hotel. Bye bye, ABC Hotel. I'm gonna check out Keflavik for a couple hours and then head to the airport. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Go subscribe, go check out my other videos. Till next time.